It's a very good question, and in fact, like any technology-based industry, whether it's uh, computers, PC, software, we, we rely on, on this capital asset uh, driving the industry and our, our products and innovations forward. How do we develop that? Well, we have to start early on. Um, we are, as Hughes, for example, involved with a program called FIRST, which is an initiative in high school to encourage kids to study science, technology, engineering type math uh, subjects. And there's contests for them. They, they have this great co competition annually in multiple locations. It's now global. Kids coming from the UK, from Scotland, from France, from all over, from Latin America even. And, and th what they do, they build a robot and they compete and see who can win in the robotic fight. Every year there's a slightly different game context. But that's an example of starting at the grassroots. Get kids excited about engineering and technology. And then as it goes forward, now when we're in the industrial side, uh, we have programs specifically for training our installers. We have a huge dealer installer network as Hughes. Other companies do the same. And uh, GVF, the Global VSAT Forum, is helping with that because they now have these online uh, educational training programs specifically targeted to different kinds of actions like installing a, a dish and how to point it and, and working with a knock in a particular network center, you know, if it's Hughes and, and, and so forth. So uh, the industry as a whole recognizes the challenge and we're trying to live up to it. We have even things like VSAT installation contests in Russia <laughs> where, you know, in fact, the last uh, one, I think the winning time was about seven and a half minutes. That's pretty amazing from equipment in a box to install the VSAT, connected, pointed, validated, working, you can commission the customer. And we're seeing us in the field, not seven and a half minutes, but we are with the new technology with Jupiter, for example, our installer base is doing about three and possibly four installs a day, where in the past they could only do two. So that shortens the, the time to market for the product. It makes customers happier. Uh, the quality is better. Uh, and in the end, uh, we uh, do better on the bottom line because it costs less money. So that whole training and, and development of talent and then down to the installation level uh, is a very important ongoing initiative and I think the uh, industry is meeting that challenge.